waterproofing the block at my new house. Last week I did the back of the house as well as the left side, so today I'm working on the right side. And by now I feel like I should be a pro at this, however at the end I wanted to cry. I'm using a modified thin set that is rated for exterior on concrete masonry. I'm just using a paint roller to literally just roll it right on the block. Because the block is porous, it will literally just suck the water right out of that thin set. So I'm first using a sponge just to dampen the block. And I am just soaking that roller with a thin set, making sure that I put enough all over that block. And then I'm applying this thin waterproof membrane by Guru that I got from Place for Pros. It is a four layer membrane that is used to waterproof showers, exteriors, or even pools. And when I say this stuff is tough, you can't even rip it if you tried. So after doing a lot of research on different type of waterproofing, I decided to go with this one. I felt that it was best for our application and also won't let the water or the salt through the block. So once I apply it to the wall, then I'm just using my trowel to make sure the area is nice and smooth and all the air bubbles are out. And once all of the dirt is brought in and graded on our lot, about two feet of this is going to be covered anyways and be underground. But I wanted to go ahead and waterproof it now to get as low to that footer as possible. And any of the areas on the membrane that I had to cut for the pipes to come through, I'll be going back later on with silicone to make sure that that stays nice and sealed. And it was at that point that I wanted to cry. Time lapse definitely helps, but I was so annoyed that that whole thing fell down. But in the end, got the entire wall done. So on to the next. 